welcome back everybody. This week, I'm pleased to announce that we have a challenge and the challenge will include your families, your friends, your animals, your pets, anybody who wants to be part of this and you are going to recreate a masterpiece. I've put together a couple of examples. As you can see here, I'm trying to look like Yayo Kusama but I have a couple of examples of artworks that I've tried to recreate. Some more successful than others. I'm gonna invite you to do the same. Now you do not need to get dressed up. You might want to get your laundry together and recreate a masterpiece. You might want to paint like I did the background for my Van Gogh and place myself in there. You might want to recreate a work that doesn't have anybody in there. You might want to recreate a work that has your whole family in there. I'm giving you two weeks to do this because it's a bit of a challenge and I'd love you to think about it. And I'd love you to choose a work that resonates, means something to you. So in the past, I've done this with year three students when we were investigating Impressionism. The students painted the background of paintings and then they went and found costumes and placed themselves into the background and we took photos to recreate the painting. So I'm going to give you those as examples and hopefully give you some inspiration. I'm also going to show you what I've done. Now, this should be a fun activity and this is hopefully bringing us together as a community and I would love at the end of this to share. We could share in a little virtual art gallery and I would love to be able to share some of these pictures with us when we go back to school and place them up. Good luck! I attempted to look like Van Gogh by using face makeup and a painted background. Frida Kahlo has always been a favourite of mine, so I've tried to capture her essence, placing flowers in my hair using jewellery and costume. Oh, and my son's monkey. In the 60s, black and white photography was more prevalent than colour photography, so this was a simple one to recreate using black and white photography. I recreated Sandra Silberg's wig portrait using lots of face makeup and a few scarves. A wig and lots of dots helps me become Yayoi Kusama. series of five works, students investigated the art of Impressionism and recreated the famous paintings. They painted the backgrounds, they found costumes that would be appropriate and props that would work and placed themselves inside of the backgrounds to create or recreate these famous paintings. Aren't they gorgeous? I hope you've been inspired to try something. Now you might want to find objects around the house, found objects. You might want to use face paint. You might want to do whatever. It's really quite an open brief. I can't wait to see your results. Please write to me if you need assistance or you need inspiration. Um, let's go for it. Let's see what we can do, Carmel.